Yeah, now we're talking. And here comes one of our favorites. Starting as one of the superstars in the ring is one thing. You know what you have to do, but what about the superstars that start in the pods, Byron? It's all about a game plan. It's about understanding when you're in your pod, looking at how the action is breaking down, understanding what you need to do once you get into this incredibly difficult match. Saxton, everyone has a plan until they get hit in the mouth. That certainly applies here. Corey makes a good point. Plans are one thing, but reality has a way of intruding. He must have seen that coming. Escobar turns it around. Uh-oh. Shifts it back onto him. Reversal on top of reversal. Look at this. Snap suplex. in the corner. Saw it coming. Here we go. Axiom's pot is open, and he's going to get himself some of this chamber. Side headlock applied. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. Oh, my Lord! Oh, what a chop block. Focus that attack at the base. Can't put together much offense with no base. into the ring, and that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Challenger's a little worse for wear now, but he knew he'd take a beating inside the chamber. He prepared for this and still has plenty left in the tank. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Goops, there are pulling up for a backdrop suplex, followed by a German, and they're, they're still holding on. They're still holding on to their opponent this time. Chaining together punishment, looking to do as much as possible with this window. Champ caught off guard by that. Just whiplash impact right to the head on that one. Unbelievable athleticism. That maneuver goes to show you how much speed kills. Pinpointing the leg in the corner. Payne must be shooting through that leg now. Oh, what an elbow high on the chin. Corey, what's in a competitor's mind when battling inside this mammoth structure? Adapting. Uh-oh, top row in deep, deep trouble here. We're going to get a little creative. Any move from the top like that is nearly catastrophic. Lokus next into the bedroom of the chamber. He saw it coming. Oh, look at this. You can't be serious right now. It's very serious, Saxton. Hurricane Lana. Unbelievable athleticism. Agility like, oh, no. Not so fast. Hurricane Lana. Off the top. What's he gonna do? From the top! Oh, misses the mark! And Axiom got turned around there. So to get his hands dirty here, to join in on the chaos of the chamber. Showing off the quickness, that'll turn things around in a hurry. What a counter. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Who can talk like that to be trouble for the champion if they want to leave? 
move here with the title. the clothesline. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. That kind of agility is something that just might get the champ shook. When the challenger can come at you from all angles, that makes for a very dangerous. Oh, nowhere. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm has shifted, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Position here. Oh, snake eyes caving in their face. Solid contact from the Viper. Oh, man. Randy Orton hoisting up his opponent with a fall away slam. Escobar able to dodge that. Sends him into the corner. Hoisted up. Suplex deliver. The challenger being outclassed here. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Boom! Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drop. Taking flight. Denied and reversed into the power slam. Climbing the turnbuckle now. High stakes here. He does not want to be there. You got to be kidding me. No, I can't wait. Oh, 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 God, that does it. That'll do it. Risking life and win off the chamber pond. Superstars left. This superstar is obviously trying to end this in a big way. Why wait? Let's do it now. There's no getting up from this. Oh my god. From the top. Butterfly suplex. A strong head scissors application. And now the elbows. Oof. Somehow these superstars just keep upping the ante. And no one is backing down now. Not after everything they've been through. Oh, there's the old. He's reeling, slowly getting up. Dodgers out of the way. Oh, man. oh this could be something. Omega drive. Looks like the chair is going to be tamed. We are looking at three superstars who are left to battle inside the chamber. Boom! Orton able to counter. Boom! Oh, what an uppercut. Oh. He manages to escape it. Unbelievable athleticism. Orton with great ring awareness. Tough position to be caught in here. What a throw! Vicious right forearm. Oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Utilizing the top rope to inflict more punishment. Oh, draped over the top. Probably not going to win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goats curses him. And he got in there. I thought that was it. Ow! Measuring. Oh, face stop. Orton getting ready. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. From the top. 
Whoa, look out! Trying to do as much damage as humanly possible. But at what cost? Boom! What a close line! Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Then meanwhile, Axiom. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Oof, turned it into a jawbreaker. Oh, countered into a power slam. He gets back into the ring. Oh, no lights! Look at this crowd! It's insanity in here! Bedlam! No way! We got a new champion! Unbelievable! There's always controversy in the aftermath of a six-man elimination chamber match, but I'm just stunned at how incredible that match really was. Here is your 